Hello everybody, this is Lady Random, and welcome to Graveyard Shift, which um, I know nothing about except I guess we're a worker and we're doing a Graveyard Shift. Okay, let's get started. It's supposed to be very spoopy. In the silence of the night, demons ambush our thoughts, and madness unfurls its flags in our hearts. For sometimes the darkest corners of our minds have their own demonic allure. Okay. I mean, it looks good. Spooby music! Dark phobia games. <sighs> I'm sorry for cats in the background. Of course there's crows. I mean, I think those are crows. December 1995, Whispering Wind Cemetery. Why do cemeteries always have such weird names? Okay. Oh no, I got an achievement. Welcome. Okay, welcome to the graveyard. Alrighty then. So are we here for a funeral? I mean, that is a hearse, right? That looks like it's supposed to be a hearse. Whoa! Oh my goodness. Dizzy. No lighter. Okay. Woo! Hi there, father. Do you talk? I can jump. It does have controller support, but I don't think it's very good, so we're gonna just do this. I'm glad to see you. And I'm sure we've hired a great guardian. Whoa, you creepy. I know that during the first few nights, you might not feel comfortable in this place, and may be a bit scared, but you'll get used to it soon. I would rather work in a graveyard than in a funeral home, or a morgue, or a mortuary, whatever. This cemetery is the most peaceful place at night, and you'll find enjoyment in the tranquility and silence of this place. Who are you to say I'm gonna find tranquility at night in a graveyard? Of course, you need to be very vigilant and make sure no one enters. You should know that many famous people uh, buried here. What is the obsession with dead famous people? I really don't care. Go to Johnny's to get all the details from him. Okay. Johnny, where are you? Alright. Uh, Johnny's? Is this Johnny's? Let's see. Oh. No, it doesn't have anything. Okay. It's locked. Okay. Where the heck is Johnny? Is that... Um, that looks like a church. Uh, is Johnny's in, Johnny in this little shed over here? Let's go take a look. Creepy little shed. Why is this door so high? Are we just, like, really short? No. That door is just really, really high. I mean, at least the lock is. I mean, I we're kind of short. Yeah, I guess we're kind of short, huh? Yeah, we're, we're short. Okay. Can I go in? Okay, that's weird. Why are there different color lights on? Red, orange. Oh, you're creepy. Hi. Can we talk? Hello. Oops. Hi, Frankenstein. Hello? No interaction? Okay. I guess we can't talk to Frankenstein there. Alright. Um. This is like the worst church ever. This place sucks. Who would want to go here? The tranquility my butt. This is freaking nightmare fuel. Okay. What the heck is Johnny's at? This is a mausoleum. So he ain't gonna be in there. Johnny! Shut up, you stupid crows. Or ravens, and I get. Ah, oh, here we go. This must be Johnny. You must be the new night shift guard. 
You should know that guarding the cemetery isn't easy. Why? Why is it hard? Ghosts, ghouls, vampires, uh, idiots trying to break in? The cemetery is equipped with CCTV cameras due to the burial of many famous individuals. You must regularly check the cameras and never let anyone in. I'm just saying this does not look like a cemetery for famous people. This place kind of looks like it's falling apart. Tonight, the cemetery has three guests. Due to the time constraints and a lack of proper and secure mortuary around the city, they had to store the bodies of the ghost rock group here tonight. Tomorrow, the funeral for these will be held, and you must be very attentive at the cemetery. Why? There's something very important that the priest told me not to tell you, but I'll share it with you. The previous night shift guard died of a heart attack. Oh no! And we found his body at the church door with a bluish complexion and a terrified look on his face. Dude, this is how you scare away new security guards. I don't want to scare you, but I thought it's better that you know and stay more alert. If you have any questions or encounter any issues, Please contact me. Remember to regularly check the cameras. So if the heart attack and the blue face were unusual, why wasn't it investigated? Also, why are like we short like help if this is supposed to be a famous cemetery with famous individuals and... Bye! Okay. Do I shut the gate? Okay, I guess we just leave the gates wide open and go around. Shut up. Why are you circling like there's dead carry-on or something on the ground? Stupid birds. Frickin' too bad this game ain't duck hunt. You gonna talk to me now, Frankenstein? Uh, excuse me, sir. I must ask you to leave this place. This cemetery is closed from 5 p.m. onwards. And oh. I have to lock the gate. Oh, you scared me! Oh my goodness, that scared the crap out of me! Seriously, that scared me. I thought for a second that was the dude. No, that's our character talking. Holy crap, I'm holy. Alrighty then, bye. Okay, so they said three visitors. So, weirdo there is one. Frankenstein is one, I think. Look at how he walks! <laughs> Let's see if it lets me lock the gate right now. He's like dancing or something. Ooh, can I follow? No, hold on me. Okay, I can lock the gates now. He seemed nervous. Did he get upset by my words? Okay. Church, security room, fuse. Oh, of course it's a fuse. It's a horror game. There's always a fuse. Warehouse, dissection hall. Ew. 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 Why is there a dissection hall? I mean, you don't... You're not... Do you mean embalming room? Gross. We have a heart meter. Awesome. Okay. Alright, well, let's go check the CCTV cameras. Oh, wait. Let's just go the other way. No, we're just going with the lawn around a little bit. Are you guys gonna get up and move? Hey, look! It's the famous painting, Girl with the Pearl Earring! Is that a dumpster? No. This is a frickin' basement thing. Door to underground storage basement. Can I go through here? Crouch. Looks like there's no crouch. We don't have a flashlight. Okay. Spoopy, spoopy music. Um, the, the only thing that scared me so far was Frankenstein, and that was his sudden talking. Okay, let's go watch the CCT cameras. Oh boy, I can't wait. Can I close the door behind me at least? That'd make me feel a little better. Can I lock it? Now that is interesting. The fact that I can close and lock the door means that uh, makes me wonder if something's gonna try to break in and kill me. 
Okay, well, you know, you know, because usually when I play horror games and I'm like wandering around, I'll close doors behind me because I'm afraid something will follow me into the room. But normally there's a, the mechanic doesn't really matter. This game, it seems to. All right. Let's see what do we got here. Garbage, garbage, garbage. Horrible music. I'm sorry if you love the music. It sounds horrible to me. Um, wow, somebody's messy. TV don't work. So gross. All right. Um, all right, well, I guess. Beep, beep. Okay. Oh, creepy. What the heck? Oh. Looks like we got some kind of leak. Oh, look, that's totally not creepy, not at all. All right, where was that? There's some kind of leak or something we gotta fix. Okay, let's go figure out how to fix the leak. Oh, there's no way to exit until I go through all of it. All right. Okay, well, I guess we could Updates. Examine the water pipe. Okay. Creepy church. Where is the water pipe? I hate this place already. It sucks. This place is awful. What the heck? Oh. I Doggo! Doggo! Are you a ghost dog? Are you one of those graveyard doggos? What are they called? Oh, oh, I can't think of what it, I can't remember what it's called. Have you ever heard the cries of a demon? And that gave me a cheap and I have no idea what it said. Okay, so let's turn off the water. I guess. Okay. Check the CCTV. Hi! How are ya? You gonna disappear when I get near ya? Okay, bye. I can't believe my eyes! Oh no, dead people in a graveyard! Okay. We're gonna be cautious every single time, because I'm not a fool. Alright, let's see now. Okay. Okay, looks like it's fixed. Then why is that wheelchair so... Why is there a wheelchair there? That is really just weird. Oh, look! A body's on the floor! <sighs> really? Really? <sighs> so, I'm guessing the band members or whatever they were were killed in an accident and they're angry and they're not at rest and they're gonna, they're gonna haunt me. Oh, yeah, that's right. A change has occurred in the dissection hall. Check it out. Okay. So, this remind. Oh, that's loud. This reminds me of those, um... I forgot what that game is called, where you have to find anomalies. But not exactly. I do like CC... I do like the idea of a CCT game with uh, creepy graveyard and stuff and having to check what's going on. This was locked before, though. Is it going to let me in? Yeah, it's unlocked now. Oh, this is where the wheelchair is. Okay. I'm nosy. Nobody in there? Okay. It won't let me look. I'm nosy. I, I know. Morbid curiosity. I, I cannot help myself. Anybody in here? Hello? What's over here? That door's locked. Okay, that means the body's in here. <sighs> ah, I hate you! That was cheap scare. Cheap! Hear me? Cheap. Who's knocking bodies on the floor? Seriously. What if I wasn't strong enough to pick this up? Oh, one, two, one, two! Now stay put, okay? Or I'm gonna have to strap you guys down, you hear me? Why don't we just strap them down? Serious. You know what? It probably won't matter with ghosts. Not. Oh boy! 
Really? Really? Okay. Okay. <laughs> Why did the priest lie to me? Dude, you, you're a priest. You're not supposed to be lying. Is that a skull? A skull that is not... A, what? Another achievement. I, I couldn't see it. A skull that is not... We don't know if the skull is real or fake. Okay. I mean, it looks fake to me, but... I mean, it's not like these are photorealistic graphics, so... Oh, I guess we'll just leave it there. Spoopy! I have a feeling we're gonna die. I wonder... Uh-oh, phone's ringing. You better run. So, this is either gonna go to one of two ways. I mean, well, no, duh. I don't even know why I'm saying that. Either just gonna have a bad end or we're gonna die, or there's gonna be a bad end and a good end. Because it won't just be a good end. It's never just a good end. What do you want? What? I'm sorry, I don't speak spoopy ghost. Yes, I don't speak spoopy ghost. Did I lock the door? Good. Yes, it needs to stay locked. I'm sure something's gonna show up in the window eventually, because that's why a window is conveniently located right next to me. All right, let's see what's going on this time. Is that somebody by the gate? Okay, let's check when it goes back. Yeah, there's somebody by the gate. Hi, who are you? I thought the plague was over. Okay, let's go see what the weirdo at the gate wants. A guy's staying in front of the door. I don't need to tell him to go. He will understand. Okay. Maybe I'm just dumb. I swear the door wouldn't open. Let's try this again. No, the door won't open. Oh, here we go. Um, a letter. A very frightening nun on the east side of the cemetery standing over a grave, but I don't dare to approach her. Her crying is intensely eerie and disturbing, and it's unbearable. I have recently found a solution that can make her voice somewhat more tolerable for you. Just whisper Jesus Christ 20 times. We don't know who the nun is, but I am certain that she is not human. Okay, so we have evil ghost nun? Weirdo's still there. Maybe we should watch him for a minute. Hi. Do you know how creepy you are? Are you gonna break the camera? What am I supposed to do if it doesn't let me out? Did I break the game? <gasps> Maybe I broke the game. Oh, I need to sleep. I didn't know that. Okay. That's what I get for not checking the to-do list. Okay. I am locking the door before I go to sleep. I need to take a nap. Yeah, it's a good idea to take a nap after you lock the door. I, I'm sure that lock serves some purpose. Okay, this is a nightmare. Okay, so we're gonna wander around in a cemetery. Endless, endless cemetery of crosses. Okay. Are we being chased? Oh boy, fun! Um... What am I supposed to do? Just keep running? <sighs> oh, they might not be endless after all. Look at that. Okay, I guess we'll go this way. It won't let me go forward anymore, so we'll go. I don't know. I'm just picking random directions. I mean, obviously, they're not completely random. You can only pick four ways to go. Okay, can't go that way. All right, well, let's go the other way. Looks like that's where we're supposed to go. I mean, there's some kind of shiny light or beacon or sparkly thing over there. 
Oh, it's a okay. It's a lamppost. All right. I'm guessing that's where we're supposed to go. Is this is this our grave? Is it gonna have our? Oh, look! It, this is our grave, right? Somebody gonna push us in? Oh no! Whispering. Hello. Oh no! We fall in. Ah! Are we gonna fall out of bed and wake up? the floor. That would have been funnier. We fell out of bed and it jolted, jolted us awake. Hey, is the window open? What? Why is this dish spilled? The door's unlocked. The door is unlocked. Oh, man. Somebody broke in. Alright, well, let's check... Check the CCT. <sighs> Grapper's gone. Oh, look how dark it is in there. I don't like this. Where'd the note go? Look, the notes... Okay, here's the flashlight. That wasn't there before. Okay, well... Pick the flashlight up and find a way to disable the car alarm. Okay. Oh, lovely. Is How about if I kick the car? Will that disable it? Ooh, that's from the creepy nun ghost. Sister Creepy, are you here? Sister Creepy. I don't know what her name is. So is she here for... Here... I can't even talk. I'm just gonna call her Sister Creepy. Ghost Doggo! Woo! Alright, what do we got here? Weird. Seriously, who decided these lights were a good idea for the graveyard? Oh my gosh, I'm coming. Shut up. I need a tool in the warehouse. Okay, so is the warehouse going to be magically unlocked now? I like the light. Oh, I thought the light was blinking. Maybe I'm seeing things. I. Somebody's going to lock me in. Look. Somebody's going to lock me in. Not gonna shut the door. All right, we got a wrench. No, what is this? Is this to break the glass? That looks like something we. Use. They're not gonna be happy with me breaking the glass. Don't we have like a number we can call and tell them the car alarm's going off? I mean, do we really have to resort to breaking the glass? Are there no other options? There's a crowbar. Are we not gonna take that? Seriously, are, are we not gonna take the crowbar? Okay, I guess we I guess we're gonna go break the glass. Okay The door gonna slam shut in my face Surprisingly no I have to disconnect the car's alarm wire otherwise the car's battery may run out. Oh, okay I thought we we're gonna I don't I don't know what the tool is. I thought we we're gonna break the glass. Okay. Well, that was easy. Go back to the security room. Okay. And I'm sure there's a weirdo in the security room now. Shut up! Shut up! You're annoying. I don't like you. Oh, wait. Flashlight. Nobody cares about you and your problems. Stay dead. Go haunt somebody else. Did I leave that door open? Of course the power goes out! Because why wouldn't it? The fuse is blown. Find the fuse. <sighs> fuse, fuse, fuse. Fuse, fuse, fuse. What is this? Uh, this is an urn. 
Fuse, fuse, fuse. Fuse should be somewhere around here, right? There we go. Oh, that looks dangerous. Check the CCTV. So we we fixed it just by doing that? Okay. Alrighty then. Makes perfect sense, I guess. Oh, really? Okay. <laughs> okay. I guess locking the door doesn't seem to matter, but we're gonna do it anyway. Seriously, you're just gonna leave that on the floor? That's gross. Gotta track all the ants. Alright, let's see what the problem is now. Because we can't even do anything without something going wrong! Oh, really? Oh, look! The body's missing! Oh, no! Oh, no! So one, I can't tell if the second body's missing. The first body's definitely missing. Yeah, see, this is when you call the police. Let's see, what is it? Examine the change made in the dissection hall. You would not, okay, if there's a body missing from the body bag, you ain't gonna have, no, no, I ain't gonna check that. Cause you know, even if it's not a zombie or a ghost, that means there's a real person out there. Somebody's messing with you, and they probably want to kill you. But I guess our security guard here isn't too bright. Can we pull all the police? No, we're not. We're not smart. We're not smart. The other security guard probably wasn't very smart either, and that's why they died. So, okay, let's go die. Because obviously we're not smart. Because if we were smart, we'd call the police. How could the bodies have raised? Because they're zombies, and the place is haunted. That's why. How about you leave? How about we uh, just not stay here? But no, not smart. Can I leave? Let's go see if leaving is an option. I don't know why horror protagonists are so... Woo! Shut up. Let me leave. Can we leave? I mean, we can tactically leave, right? Nope, we're too stupid. Too stupid. Yeah, I don't know why horror protagonists are so stupid half the time. They literally, he, he might as well just write a sign that says kill me and stick it on this person's back. <sighs> We're gonna just leave that open. Normally I'd close the door, but... Did that just close on its own? I'm locked in. It locked me in. It locked me in. Of course it did. Incoming jump scare! Incoming jump scare. Is the back door open? <sighs> Incoming jump scare! Be prepared! Of course, the light goes out. Find a way out. Okay. See, we wouldn't be in this mess if you weren't an idiot. Okay, both bodies are missing. We wouldn't be in this mess if you weren't an idiot and just had to investigate. You could see very well from the CCTV what was going on. The bodies were missing. Duh! Staff only? Nope. Let's go back out the door. And a key should be around here. Okay. We will not be buried here. Okay, I get it. The bandmates don't want to be buried in this dump. I got it. I don't blame you. This place sucks. Can't we just, like, break the glass? I mean, we already did enough damage to this dump, so... <sighs> Alright, you guys can just stay in there. Let me guess. There's gonna be a key in one of the freaking coffins. Or caskets. Oh. Okay, which one has the key? <laughs> it moved. Something moved. Something moved. Something moved. Are you in here? Oh, window. The window's open. Why can't we go out the window? The freaking window's open. It won't let me go out the window. Oh, no. The end's like, nope. Screw you. Gotta find a key. Oh, there's the key. Someone gonna come up and bite me? Jump scare, jump scare, jump scare. Let's close this door. 
Okay. Um, I thought I picked up a key. Okay, will it open the back door? Of course it opens the back door. Oh, look, it's the incinerator. Awesome. Okay. All right, well, at least now we got a weapon, I guess. Don't mess with me. I guess, I mean, I, although I don't think an axe would, you know, be very useful against some, against some ghosts unless it was some kind of, you know, holy axe or blessed axe or something. Or silver axe if we happen to be dealing with vampires or werewolves. Seriously? Really? 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 Okay. Are we going to break the coffin open? I'm confused. I thought I had a key. Did I not pick up the key? Are we going to break the window open? Lady is so confused. No, 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 no. Light can stay on. Oh, look. The third one's gone. Oh, I see. <laughs> Lock the door, I guess. Why do all these doors have locks? Do they not have functions? Well, this is what we gotta do. I guess. <laughs> okay, let's follow the ghost zombie thing. It's gonna tell me to go back to CCTV. My flashlight broken? Find a way out, okay. Nope. Go through the... Oh, wait. Keep Johnny informed by phone. This place sucks. Like, seriously. Worst gig ever. Alright. This flesh, it sucks too. Alright. What are we gonna run into next? I can't wait. Watch the phone not work. Hi. Yeah, I hate you too. Let's call Johnny. Hello? Hello, Mr. Johnny. There's a problem. What's going on there? I just realized that the bodies are not in their place. What should I do? Mr. Johnny? I can't hear you. Can you hear me? Oh, Jesus. Oh no, oh no, whatever shall we do? I guess we'll check the stupid CCT cameras again. Are the bodies gonna be wandering around? Hey, it's an idiot from earlier. That's who that is. What are you doing, moron? Who's, go who's Greg you digging up, dipshit? No signal. So the room where the three bodies were is, uh, the camera isn't working, and some weirdo, the one presumably from earlier, is, um, digging up a grave. Um, I don't know if all of this is supernatural. This feels like an actual person doing this. So, I don't... I checked the CCTV. Do we just sit there and want, hey buddy, you're on TV, you're famous! I guess we should go, you know, he looks like he's got a weapon, so it might not be the smartest thing to go confront him. Then again, we're not smart, so. Eh, what the heck. Let's go say hi! Oh wait, it updated. Apparently someone is digging a grave in the cemetery, check it out. Dude, they're probably digging your grave. I thought they were digging up a grave, but I guess they're digging a grave, okay. Hello, are you digging a grave for me? Oh, are you digging a grave for the ghost nun? Aren't you here? Am I gonna get pushed into the grave? Is this where you were? Where'd it go? Where'd you go? Buddy, where'd you go? Hello, hello. Oh, he dug that grave. Wait, oh, you gonna push me in? 
Ew. <laughs> Escape from the graveyard through the gates. What the heck? There's something wrong with this graveyard. I have to leave this cemetery as soon as possible so I don't die myself. But I wanted to say hi. Okay. Ghost Nun, are you still here? Ghost Nun? Sister Creepy? I'm disappointed. I was promised a Ghost Nun and the Ghost Nun was not delivered. Instead, we just got some weird, nasty, decaying dude in a freaking black robe. Was that the priest by any chance? Oh, no. <sighs> Creepy moaning. Was I supposed to be a cemetery guard? Or what? Oh, no, I'm sorry. Was I supposed to be a cemetery guard or a dang glow? Was I supposed to be a cemetery car? I missed that. It was something about supposed to be a cemetery guard or a damn ghost club. I'm sorry, I missed it. I got all tongue-tied. All right, the gate's gonna be locked. We're not gonna get out, be able to get out, or something's gonna. Oh look, yeah, look. Or something's gonna come up behind and get us. Oh no, the lock's been changed. Oh no. Hi. Who are you? Okay, we'll go back to the security room, I guess. I mean, it's not like we're safe in there. Actually, not while I'm here. Kind of curious. Is it still locked? Yeah, it's still locked. Okay. Shut up, stupid noises. Oh, look, the door's shut. And we probably can't get in. I don't know, surprisingly, it's not. So are these little locks here, these little bolt locks here, just for, you know, like, uh, the illusion of security? To make me, like, give me illusion of safety? Because they don't seem to be doing anything. That's where the idiot was digging the grave. <laughs> Hi! I didn't know Sadako was in this. Or, I'm sorry. Yeah, Sadako. Hi there. Is that the church? There was someone in the church. Check out. Dude, why are you in so... Why are you so insistent on checking all this horrible stuff out? Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. When it comes to survival of the fittest, this dude's on the bottom of the... Uh, yeah, his this guy's on the bottom of the pyramid. Or the food chain. I should have said food chain. He's on the bottom of the food chain. Alright, let's go, uh, go to Hada Sadako. That was cheap. And lame. Cheap, lame. Jump scare. Those are the worst kind. What kind of church is this? What is this? Letter. We, the buried ones in the cemetery, have a message for you. For years, a demon has been buried here, tormenting our souls. Now you are condemned to destroy the demon within the cemetery and save us from torment. Otherwise, a harsh death awaits you. Oh, great. So I have to be the hero of the cemetery and get rid of the demon. Awesome. Okay, so I have to follow the footprints. Oh, no. Well, I don't think I've ever seen demonic footprints quite like that before. Especially in white paint. Okay. Can I get, like, a Bible or something? Some holy water? A crucifix? Anything? Guess not. Okay. Seriously, though, why three feet? Where are we going? I mean, it would be nice if this has a good ending, but I don't really expect it to. Oh, do we get to see Sister Creepy now? Why am I going back to the shed? No, we're not. We're going to the graveyard. Okay. Mausoleum. Great. Okay, it's locked. I need a tool to break the door lock. Alright, well, 
Well, we already know it. Uh, we need now the other uh, horror game staple, the crowbar. Okay, let's go get the crowbar. You gonna lock me in this time? Guess not. Okay. Am I going to get locked in the mausoleum and eaten by Dracula? Oh, this would be a weird place for Dracula to be. Uh, uh, I'm super strong. There we go. They led me here. There must be something important here. See, who is they? That's the problem. Who is they? Three footprints in white paint doesn't seem good to me. I, I'm just, I'm just saying. Oh, no, don't make me crawl. Apparently, we don't have to crawl because we're really short. This is a weird mausoleum. Okay. Is the priest a demon? Smith. Okay. 1932. Creepy, spoopy sounds. Taylor, 1940. So... What's the 1940 here? If there's a, I mean, obviously this is a family mausoleum, but... Why the year? Is that when they were, the first person was buried there? Or the f entire family's wiped it at one point, and that's when they all died. Look! Oh no! Somebody's standing there! Oh no! Who is it? Oh no! Oh look, they're gone. Scary. Okay, we're going back up the stairs. Jones. 1945. Okay. So we got two ways to go now. Roberts, 1951. So the dates are becoming more recent. Oh, lovely. <laughs> Look at it! Look at it! Oh, just sitting there with his creepy little glowing eyeballs. I see you! Anything in here? No. Idiot. Look at this thing. Oh, you're so spoopy. Where'd you go? Moron. Alright, let's see. We've got Johnson, 1968. Wait, was it something? Looks like somebody's back there. But that's probably just a reflection of an urn. All right, can we go this way? I don't think so. No, it won't let me. Yeah, okay, we have to go this way. It was worth a check. This place sucks. Looks kind of abandoned, honestly. Glowy eyeballs! Oh, are those multiple glowy eyeballs or are those candles? I can't tell. What the? Well, there's a letter. Whoa. I'm getting some Resident Evil and remake vibes here. Williams or Parrington, youngest child between books and running corpses. Okay. Williams or Parrington. Alrighty then, I have no idea. Is that a puzzle? Okay, so, yeah, it's Williams or Parrington, so 1916. Hi. Oh, that's a statue. Okay, so it's, it's, a, it's a puzzle. So Williams or Parrington, youngest child between books and rotting corpses. Okay, so we're looking for... I'm guessing it's a puzzle. Do we have names here? Okay. Um, I don't see anything over here. Well, let's go check over here. Looks 
looks like somebody's praying there. Okay, bye. Is this the one we gotta check? Or are you just gonna be weird and disappear and not give me any clues? Okay. We got an achievement. Coffin inspector. Okay. There's the key. Alright, well, I'm guessing that's the key for the weird... This casket and this weird casket setup. What is this? Is this some kind of vampire that's gonna save us? Or is this where the demon is buried and we have to get rid of it? Is this a demon? The candles are lit as if someone was here today. So is the priest responsible for this? Any kind of, um... Letter or something? Wow, we are really short. Oh, there we go. There's an axe. Okay, so I guess we're gonna... Um, let whatever's in here out, which is probably not a good idea. My poor ears. Alright, let's let it out. Against my better judgment. Okay, it's got... Okay, let's see. What do we got here? In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, Elias, although the devil has possessed your body and soul in this transient world, from today you will peacefully rest in eternal sleep because the merciful Lord keeps you away from the devil. Elias, might the Lord forgive your sins and place your soul in peace. 1917. Obviously, the Lord didn't uh, put you in peace. Oh, okay, yeah, I guess we set you on fire. Exit the tomb. Okay, bye, Elias. Have a nice afterlife. Is it gonna let me out? Alright, what are we gonna find now? Someone's gonna run in, like, someone's gonna try to kill me and scare me and... I have no reason to walk, so we're, we need to get out of this dump. Run. I'm gonna get locked in here. This is gonna have a bad ending. Not looking behind me. I don't remember there being a ladder. Oh, screw you. I don't remember there being a ladder here. There wasn't a ladder here. There wasn't. I'm gonna get knocked off the ladder or something. There wasn't a ladder here. Where did the ladder come from? That was weird. There wasn't a ladder. Where are we? Are we in the cemetery still? No, there's no way it's gonna have a good end. Let's see. Get back to the security room. Where am I? I don't think that did anything. Alright, well, let's... I hear crying from there. I will go check. No! 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 Don't make me check! Why are you making me check? You know what? Never mind. I guess we finally get to see creepy, uh, Sister Creepy. I get my wish comes true! All right, well, let's go see her. <laughs> Hi there. <laughs> Achievement unlocked. I missed it again. Okay, well, we got to see Sister Creepy. There's a night vision camera? Okay. So, is that... Alright. You, you just had to go and check, didn't you? Of course you did. I really don't think burning that body did anything. Can we leave? Can we just leave? Well, why won't you let me leave? The, that lock is gone. But it still won't let me leave. Dude, you are really committed to your job, aren't you? Wait, were those there before? I mean, um... That's a weird setup for, um, flowers. Okay. Ooh, spooky! Okay. Not that it matters. Oops. I guess it doesn't matter. We can't lock it no more. It doesn't matter. Look. It doesn't matter anymore. It won't let me lock it.
That idiot's back. Okay. Sadako is back. Frankenstein is back. The car is going off. The other idiot's back. There is a skeleton in the wheelchair and demonic Jesus picture. Um, the bodies are hung upside down. See you in hell. Okay, bye. Devil does not burn. Great, that's awesome. Leave the area. Yep. Oh boy. Ew, we can't look. We can't leave. Oh no. The same thing that happened to the other security guard is going to happen to us. And then they're just going to hire another to win and he's going to die too. The ghosts in this cemetery are freaking useless, man. <laughs> Oh. Wasn't expecting that. Where am I? I died? Okay, apparently we died. Was I supposed to run from that thing? Wasn't, I was not, I, I mean, I guess I should have expected that, but I, I didn't. This one, maybe? Okay, let's jump into the hole. Sure, why not? Woo! Woo! Okay, I guess we're going to hell. Um. Or the. Um. Um. Underground? I mean, close enough, I suppose. How am I supposed to get out of here when I can't see what the heck I'm doing? This is annoying. Okay. Um, Purgatory? Hi there! So, are we joining all the trapped souls here? Oh boy, awesome! Awesome, what an ending. Oh boy. You know what this reminds me of? It reminds me of the, um incinerator like we're stuck and we're being sent to the incinerator that's what i'm getting for this maybe we're not okay lock me gonna lock me in well there's a tape here so i guess we'll watch it insert vhs into the device and play Please wait. Ready. Okay, play. Hello there, viewers. Today's true story is about a man who was hired as a security guard at the Whispering Winds graveyard. However, on the first night, he realizes that the spirits in this cemetery are asking him to destroy the body of a demon-possessed man buried there as it torments them. The naive and unsuspecting guard believes them and burns the body of the demon-possessed man. But he didn't know that the spirits are not visible, and everything he saw was of demonic nature. Now, the demon has awakened again, and the spirits of Whispering Winds are in torment. Death was the only punishment for this security guard. Oh my gosh. How stupid. That was dumb. So, we were the one that died? Don't look up. Don't look at up, okay? So that means we look at up, right? Guess open the door? I don't freaking know. Don't look at up. What the heck does that mean? I'm looking up. Is that the end? Oh my god, is that the end? Please don't be the end. No. Bad dream? Fever dream? Bad dream?
Mmm, looks like it was all a bad dream, huh? The bodies are in their places. There is no sign of last night's nightmare. That's good. Now there's still something wrong, though. Let's see. Meet the priest at the Exodus Cemetery. That was a pretty crappy nightmare. So much for a promised night of tranquility! Okay, let's go talk to Creepy Priest. How was the first night of guarding at Whispering Wind Cemetery? I think you'd agree that being a guard in this place revitalizes the human spirit. I think not. I think, um... I think you should find somebody else. You suck, bye. We're probably still stuck in the nightmare. We're probably still dead. Or we're gonna die. It's letting me control the car, by the way. So. Something's gonna happen. Anger weary. I guess something's gonna, we're either, like I said, we're either still in purgatory or someone's gonna pop up in front of the car. I'm gonna get in an accident and die. Take your pick. These goofy games are usually pretty predictable. Hopefully this music doesn't have a copyright claim on it, because if it does, it's getting cut out. A woman. All over the Look, there's somebody on top of the bridge. Hey, hey, hey. A woman is a woman. Yep. The dude with the eyeballs. The glasses. Oh, and don't tell me we're stuck in um, purgatory and we're in an endless loop. <laughs> what did I tell ya? Something in front of the car. There's the crash. So dumb. Oh no, we're gonna die because we caught on fire. Hey, Frankenstein! That's Frankenstein, right? I can't control this. I'm not controlling this. This is a cutscene. Is that it? Oh, we're still alive? Uh, somehow we are still alive. Have you ever heard the cries of a demon? Give it a rest. Can we just leave? I hate you. Let me leave. No, we're going to go back to the cemetery. <sighs> No, it won't let me. Okay, so do we open the trunk? What do I do? I am face palming so hard right now. If that is the end, I am just. Oh God, that was the end. <laughs> for it. That's all I can really say. It was amusing. I can't say it was good. That ending was stinky. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.